Welcome to another video tutorial. In this video, I will tell you how we can resolve the problem of ID recognize while using this shiny go tool. As in my previous video, I have already made a tutorial that how we can use this shiny go tool for gene enrichment analysis. But most of the students are facing the ID recognize problem like this. Here, let me enter a few genes of uh, glycine max for example here you can see while we have entered and we try to submit this you can see here we face a problem that id is not recognized so students are interested to know that which type of id we should place here so that this tool can easily accept this so the simple solution for this question can be accessed through this gene id example tab so you can click on this one and you can try to search and select your uh, matching species on which you want to perform your gene enrichment analysis because i am performing my gene enrichment analysis on glycine max so i will search glycine max you can see here here we found the glycine max so when you will click on this it will retrieve few gene ids you can see here here are id types and examples which all are acceptable for this tool so it means that if you want to perform gene enrichment analysis using this go shiny tool so first you need to convert your gene ids to any of these format so for this you can uh, if your list is not big so you can change your gene one by one using blast tool or using any other key converter tools so but at the last you should have any of these formats so that uh, your gene ids can be accepted by this tool so let me try to uh, take few genes from this list so that uh, we can check whether these ids are acceptable or not so let me take this one we can copy this and we can try to close this one and now here if we paste this one so and uh, if we try to submit this you can see here here now the problem of id recognize will not occur through and sometime we can change this uh, pathway database from keg to the all gene data set so it will give us some results so you can see here here are some pathways are being generated which are related to these gene ids it means these ids are accepted hopefully these gene id examples would help you to know that which type of gene ids are examples so for uh, glycine max if we talk about referencing dna peptide and exon g ids from ensemble database are also acceptable similarly from a ffy soybean database embl database geo database and hmm panther database interpro protein ids and ids from string database and unigene database are also acceptable so similarly in this way you can select your own species and try to find the examples and try to convert your gene list uh, to any of these format before uploading uh, for your gene enrichment analysis and you can perform your analysis through this shiny go tool so if you have still any problem in using this tool please let me know in the comment section thank you for watching bye bye